Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Today is our first class on the vector. Topic is vector and I am discussing today October 6, question number 6, paper 4. Okay, and the idea behind is there that we have a parallelogram. Okay, parallelogram. And according to the definition of parallelogram, if this uh, O to Q is given, O to P is P, so from here to here P. And this is uh, method is very clear tail and head. So starting from O ending at P is P. So this is a P. Starting from O ending at Q is Q. So this is Q. And the extra link is given. Okay. In parallelogram, what is the criteria? Because this length and this length equal and same direction. It means whenever they are parallel and equal in length, so they are same vectors. In this sense, if this is Q, I can say this is also Q. And if this is a P, I can say this is also P. Okay. All right. And you know that when I go backward, sign change. Like this is a P and backward is minus P. Let's start. First question. This is, if you see carefully, the, the arrow is like this. Starting from P, ending at Q, tail and head. So starting from P, ending at Q. So let me write first path. So path is, I have two paths. P to M, M to Q. Second path is P to O, O to Q. So I will go P to O, P to O, and plus O to Q. O to Q, okay. It's a very clear, uh, P to O, O to P is P, but when I go backward, sign changes, this has become minus P. And O to Q itself is equal to small Q. So I can write here small Q, this is our answer. So we have finished one part. Let's go the other part. PL, so PL, and now I have I have to look upon this click this link, and if you look at carefully, this vector is it has two ratio, and this vector has one ratio. So I can say here P to L, P to L is two, so this gap is two ratio, and L to Q, so this ratio gap is one ratio. Okay, and I will teach today inshallah a technique is called vector ratio technique. Okay. What is my target to find is a very clear PL and I thought, um, not sorry, the first I'm teaching you, write two headings. First heading is vector, second heading is ratio. This is the best way. Okay, what you unknown PL. So I will write PL. So PL vector, I will write unknown vector here, vector. And an unknown vector ratio to here, in front of it. Okay, uh, can I write, I, I wrote PL, can I write LQ here? I can write here, I can write the problem. As I don't have PL, I don't have even LQ. How I can solve two unknowns? So it means if one is unknown, second must be known. So it means I will rub it and I will look upon the same line. Do you have something known? Yes, we have known. See, so P2, I have three vectors. I am calling all names. First vector PL, one vector. Okay. Second LQ, LQ. Third is PQ, PQ. So in the whole story, which known? Naturally, this is a known, this is unknown. I put question mark, unknown, unknown. So two unknowns I can't use. With one unknown, one known must use. So I'm using PQ here. So PQ vector, and if I'm asking you that PQ, what total value I showed us two plus one. I get 3 and now simply do cross multiply and questions over. So let's start. So 3 times to PL, I'm writing here 3 times to PL equal to 2 times to PQ, 2 times to PQ and this 3 goes down and Alhamdulillah we got this link and you have PL answer is coming 2 by 3 and PQ is same. I'm copying the whole thing here. And this is my answer. You expand the bracket or no, no problem. This is my answer. So let's go for ML. I think, okay. If you expand, no issue. ML, where is ML? ML, M till L. I have two paths. One path is M to Q, Q to L, but issue, I don't have QL, okay? Another path is M to L is what? M to P, P to L. And P to L, I, luckily I have. So this path is favored for us, M to P, P to L. I'm writing here. So M to P and P to L. Okay, what is M to P? This one is equal to that. It means backward is minus Q. So I can write here minus Q. 
and PL is same. So this is I'm copying full here. Okay. So first I'm writing as this is two by three minus P plus Q. Now I'm expanding the bracket and I'll get my answer minus Q plus into this multiply with that plus into minus will give you minus two by three P and this into this multiply plus into plus plus and two by three Q. How many P's? Oh, sorry, uh, we have a, a one single P but two Q's. So I will do one thing. I will copy P as it is. But from these two, I will take common out. How they common out? I'll take plus. So this is minus one and plus two by three and Q outside. You can see again. Q into this same. Q into this same. So actually I got a two co Q common from here. So this is remains same. I'm not touching anything here. What is LCM? Three ones are three. So you know the way I just write again this one later on part number four. So position shortcut writing PV of L. Okay. What is this? Okay. Take LCM and LCM. You know very well clearly three LCM and three ones are three and plus two. And this is my last step. And I got minus one by three Q. This is my answer of a ML. Let's talk about the last part, position vector of L. Let me introduce. Whenever the word position vector comes, start from origin. Start from always origin, no any other letter. So I have to start from O and reach at L. Which part is suitable? Is this part suitable? Not at all. Reason I don't have QL. Is it part suitable? Yes. So O to P, P to L. Let me write. So OL is equal to O to P plus P to L. Okay. Now where is OP? OP is what? You know that. O to P is small p. Okay. I can copy here P. And where is PL? PL is this one. Copy as it is. Okay. I am close to my answer. Open the bracket. Plus minus minus. This into this. 2 by 3 P. Plus plus plus. 2 by 3 Q. And 2 P is I common out. Here 1. Here 2 by 3 and plus 2 by 3 q 3 was a 3 i got a 1 by 3 p or you can type in calculator and this is my answer of ol and question is finished